make 10 and 1's less than 6.4. We can show a number as a 10 and some 1's. 13, we have 13 1's. We have 10 1's that filled the 10 frame and 3 more. We can also say it's 1 10 and 3 1's. Here we have a bar of 10 and 3 1's. 10 is just 1 10 and it's 0 1's. It's just one bar of 10. We could also say it's 10 ones, couldn't we? Like this, where it would fill a 10 frame. 11, we have 110 and 11. 110 and 11. One, 12, we have 110 and 2 ones. 110 and two ones makes 12. 13, we have 110 and three ones. 14, we have 110 and four ones. 10s and 1s to show 20. We have 20. We have two 10s and zero 1s. This is the 10s place. There's two 10s and there's zero 1s. Two 10s and zero 1s makes 20. Emma has five 1s and one 10. How many does she have? We have to be very careful of the place values. It's telling us she has five ones first, but we know that we have to write the tens on this side and the ones on this side. She has five ones, and she has one ten. How many does she have? We put a one in the tens place and a five in the ones place. She has 15. What number does this picture show? Do you know what this long bar can represent? This is going to be a 10, and then we have four ones. We have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Circle the numbers that make the sentence true. There are... 0, 1, or 2 tens, and 0, 1, or 2 ones in the number 12. How many tens are in the number 12? There's one. There's a one in the tens place. How many ones are there? There's two in the ones place. If we want to make this sentence true, we'd say there's one, ten, and two ones, and it makes the sentence true. We're going to keep talking about tens. That's our next lesson, tens. It's going to be lesson 6.5. So aren't you glad this was a short little video? It was a quick lesson about making ten and ones. And I'll see you next time. Bye.